All right, how's it going? Hey, Judy, what's up? Hey, <laughs> can you come over, Stat? Something happened? Yeah. Just come. Judy, that uh -huh. was fucking rude. <laughs> how's it going, everybody? I am the Emerald Raider, and I'm joined by... The Jade Elf. And where we last left off, we were just having conversations with Rogue, with uh, Barry, and with Oda. We came down here to help Takamura, and now Judy is telling us to get to her house pronto, I guess. But Uh-oh, something might be going on with her. But she can wait. <laughs> um, it's been a while since we played. Uh, we've had a lot on our plate, but uh, we want to do some side gigs and stuff on our way to Judy. Sure. There's one literally right here, so... Listen to that guy. How'd you rate his chops? Hmm. I don't know anything about music. Not bad, I guess. To my untrained ear, sounds all right, I guess. Easy listening, at least. No, why? Technique's second rate. But the feeling? That's what counts. Guys hurt. Strumming with passion. You can't take. And it shows. Could stand a little more stage presence. Fingering's all wrong, loses the tempo more than he keeps it, but not bad. Really know how to give a guy a compliment. That how you got your start? Street busker with big dreams. Don't make me laugh. No time for playing my way to the top. Was too busy shaking the world awake. Oh God, what'd you do, Johnny? Success gives you a platform. Losers tend to say that. Oh. Uh, let's do the top one. I'm not ready. Being at the top can be worth it. Want to shake the world, you know? The world's got to feel you first. And you pay for it. You spend your lyrics laying waste to the big record corpse. Who's going to sign you then? But give up your ideals, and no amount of eddies can buy them back. All right, princess. At least you played some gigs. Saw those memories of yours. True. Played where we could. Parks, old factories, underground clubs. Had an audience from the start. Some recorded our stuff, didn't even know who we were. Old tapes could be worth something. Let me find those tapes. I'll be your fan. <laughs> um, pop one? I don't so, know. So, you're saying some old samurai bootlegs are still floating around town? I smell that. No, I You're like, I don't want to be rude to him, and I don't want to be nice to him either. Cry. <laughs> almost. Jokes aside, you think those tapes still exist after all these years? Hmm. You know, Rainbow Cadenza is not far from here. Club we played till the band fell apart. Great spot. Place for people with their heads on straight. Maybe they'll know something. Did we take the money? I think I just kicked it. I was trying to give him some. <laughs> Warsaw Catholic what? Faith and its origin. Um, as St. Augustine of Hippo taught us, to err is human, but to err willingly is to perform the work of Satan. Pope Ferdinand and the first and his successors are guilty of this heinous sin. For the perversion of Christ's teachings and their worship of the golden cow of technology and mammon, they have not only chosen this path to perdition for themselves, but have attempted to tempt the Lord's flock to follow. For the sake of millions of eternal souls he loved so dearly, Cardinal Conrad Lewandowski made the only decision God would allow. Seeing that the Vatican had renounced our Lord and Savior, he rescinded his nomination to head the Holy See and instead rested the weight of the newly founded Polish papacy on his shoulders and moved the see of the church to Lincoln, Poland. What do Warsaw Catholics believe? Warsaw Ca Catholics worship the one true god a recognized family as defined by the laws of nature our lord has provided and in accordance with the traditions followed by the blood of our ancestors two when you say i believe in god what do you mean it means we acknowledge the truth that there is one true god whose wisdom is infinite and unchanging who commands our obedience who compels us to raise families founded on love and faith who has tested poland with great suffering as he tested job thus de demonstrating that poland is god's chosen land 
man. Three, though, through whom did God reveal what we are to believe? His only son, Jesus Christ, whose earthly voice is now spoken through the Pope uh, as elected by the Polish Episcopal Conference. Four, why believe uh, the word of God? Because only through faith can we be saved and find eternal peace in heaven. Only through faith can we be true Poles, worshiping, thinking, and speaking in Polish in accordance with the customs of our fathers and mothers. Wait, so is Poland now like on America? Wow, that's a dumbass question. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, Poland is still where Poland was. I was like, Poland's still in America. <laughs> he just moved over there. Well, the Pope isn't in America either. Well, I know the Pope was in Italy, right? Yes. Oh my God. You tell me. Oh, you're so smart, my love. I'm only smart in math. <laughs> Um, Johnny? Pretty sure they turned your great spot into a slurp Oh, shop. wow. The mindless fucking consumerism wins the day again. Unless it's a front. Huh. huh. This is why you don't bring back fallen warriors. Sooner or later, they're going to see everything they fought for is turned to shit. Very true. Yo, whoever wanted to come We can eat some ramen? <laughs> Looking for some samurai tapes. What happened to Rainbow Cadenza? Let's ask that. Hey, Rainbow Cadenza mean anything to you? Oh no, another one. Aren't you too young for this? To what now? Every day, some sad grandpa in his <laughs> old leather comes in here, asks where is his old Rainbow Club, and I'm like a broken record. Tell all of them the corp brought them out 20 years ago. I should put up a sign. Looking for some samurai tape. No, anything. He's not gonna have that. From the Rainbow Cadenza days, like say, don't know, samurai stuff. Samurai. samurai. Oh, that ugly red face on black. Yeah, even I know that one. Old guy comes by here sometimes wearing their shirt. Spends the whole time yakking with his psycho fan friends. Wouldn't happen to know where I could find him? You can find him living back in the 2020s. <laughs> wow. But besides that, he's out there at the market. In our time. <laughs> Does his shop in here or what's he sell? What's he sell? What's he selling? Organic strawberries and cream. What do you think? He sells You're ancient so rude. dusty tapes of ancient dusty indie bands. No one's heard of a single one of them. Cream. Thanks. We have to talk to the cook. Been in Night City long? Been in Night City long now? Long enough to know I should not answer seemingly harmless questions. Eat, pay, and be on your way. Oh. No, fuck you. <laughs> we can look through their stuff. I don't seem to have shit. Find the vendor selling the tape. They got a couple tiger claws in here, though. So. Stupid tiger claws. You know what's so rude to me? Like when people put down other people's music. Like I personally don't like. I probably won one genre of music, but I'm like, I'm not like, oh, that sucks. <laughs> That's rude to people. Like, anyway, um, looking for good tunes. You got any la laser pop in there? Is that what it is? Laser pop? I think so. Okay, let's do the second one. Hey, looking for some good tunes. Got any laser pop? Ah, I was right. cracks? Don't sell no scop here. You either want good music or rainbow bright shite. Wow, you're rude. Oh, Jim, just a joke. <laughs> laser pop, fucking laser pop here at my stand. The tunes, I guess. Heard I can get some decent tunes here. What you mean by decent? We got Cartesian Duelist, Urdine stuff, Tainted Overlord. Any samurai? Just like on your shirt and behind you. you. And in the fucking case Never and the sign. Away. <laughs> Dancing with my axe, chipping in, you name it, we got it. Silverhand was the one true messiah of rock. Oh, I'd hand yeah, them I was gonna like, this. like candy if I could. 
But a guy's I mean, got Johnny. <laughs> Keep forgetting his real name. Silverhand's biggest fan, huh? See, I found Silverhand's biggest fan. And proud of it. Today's bitty box rockers can't even touch him. Silverhand had something they couldn't even do. Uh, silver hand? He had that fire, kid. Fire! Guy shook the foundations of the corporal world. He died for his ideals. <laughs> Doesn't matter, he was also kind of a terrorist. <laughs> Blaze way down the rebel path. Real samurai relic. Yeah, looking for the real deal. Like, say, bootlegs from Samurai's first gigs? Fuck. First, you have got no idea what you're asking for. Not if you're so, so chilled about it. Don't know how you found out about them bootlegs, but forget it. I'm not gonna give them to the first gunk off the street. Ooh, can't read that. Remember the gigs at Rainbow Cadenza? I know what they say about Johnny. Um, I know... Uh, like second one, Carpo. Let's do Carpo. Would the first gonk off the street know what they tell new Arasaka suits? They say, if a collar in training doesn't make deadline, the ghost of a man split in two will get him. Of course, nobody remembers the ghost is Johnny. All right, I'm impressed. Getting someone from Saka to tell you that. You're not joking. You're really a Silverhand fan. Yeah, we totally didn't work for Arasaka. Right? Oh shit. Johnny's always with me. Are we not cool enough yet? Nope. Milo, gotta up our cool, seriously. He's with me every step I take, every move I make. Johnny's like my conscience, my eternal, infernal moral compass. Now if you could say that a little bit more. Well said, kid. Believable. Getting a little misty-eyed. You're all right. Hey, anyways, gotta educate the youth. Maybe you'll find something special under the table. Come on, have at it. Better not be your... Oh. Is that it? Those three? Four. Who is this? The rec records. Much appreciated. Take it. Spread the good silver hand word. Death to corpus. <laughs> Not fat, fat. All right. Oh, hey, Johnny. You know, they say time is the best teacher. Used to think that was true. What the fuck is going on back there? But look at that guy. Mm. 60 at least, but still <laughs> living in 2020. Guy's your biggest fan. Not happy to meet him? Busaka Tower to smithereens, and it's still standing there. Just the same. Don't want people getting stuck in a rut, stuck in the past. Want them to change, them and the world. Uh, something must have changed. Can people can't change people by blowing them up? The first one. In sixty years, something must have changed. No, it changed. The damn facade. Fresh interface plugs, new high fructose scop syrup, and fun fruity flavors. A new face of Arasaka. Same old shit. Different packaging. Something's changing. Maybe we can't see it, but there's change all the same. Sure. Now almost nobody remembers when a person wasn't just a meat bag full of secondhand implants. Ballad of the Buck Raver. That's what was on fire on that guy. Well, we took him to the. <gasps> <laughs> so he had something up his butt? No, he had an implant, but he got it off the black market, remember? So it was on fire. Oh. This one is pretty close by, so I don't even gotta do nothing. Hmm. Oh, sorry. Is that a cyber psycho? It's uh, scavengers. Ah, uh, you're dead. This one goes on fire. Hope somebody comes and gets your body parts. 
Somebody's still standing to the left of you, isn't it? Appreciate it, sister. Oh no. There's somebody who was about to get their shit body parts stolen. <laughs> <laughs> Ow. All of these people, three, almost four. All right, heading for those fuckers. Eyes open, Chum. Keep that guard up, you know it. I'm serious, those bastard heads are effing nuts. Chill, I can take care of myself, Chum. Sure, anyway, once you push all that stuff, you know, go back to the trash for more. Stash, uh, coordinates. The F you sent me that for? Sorry, clicked something by accident. Keep the address in my phone. Just trying to remember where it is. My thumb slipped. Oops. That's a lot. <laughs> you keep ish like that in your phone? You effing gonked in the head? Just in case... I forget you effing hell delete that right now sure okay don't sure okay me do it now or you'll forget is it gone yeah yeah just a sec i'm driving us what the heck bet a million eds your gunk i forget what's all that ask the is that like the keyboard uh they gave us a coordinate yeah but i don't know how the hell they would have done that if it's in our head or was he here for this he was probably here for this stuff laminate armed collar Combative wear, but a bomber. Got some style. What the? What the fuck? Are they okay? They high as a fucking kite. Are we supposed to help them? Oh, hey, Takamura. Hello, V. Wakako Kata. You do not think she will betray us? What? She doesn't charm you anymore? Having doubts? You have nothing to worry about. Unlike me, where are you? Huh. First one? You only have to look at her. A venomous spider wearing the mask of a nice old lady, but I will not be fooled. If it were not her disdain for Arasaka, she would have sold us out for a handful of pachinko balls. Yep. But since she has not, that means she is something even more dangerous, an opportunist. Maybe she simply wants to spear two rats on one stick and is waiting for the right moment. V, I am in Kabuki. I have two questions. How can anyone call this filthy slum Kabuki? Kabuki is a form of art. True. I will let you know shortly. Thanks, Goro. Let me know if I can be of help. Uh, uh, second one i may take you up on that offer but for now i will manage alone your time will come hey goro you see we're in the dick this time we're going to the police department to tell them what we um talked to what's his face about no we're gonna go get the stash that the, they were talking about in that thing we just read Oh, that's where the coordinates are? Mm hmm The police department. That's not the police department. It just says NCPD because it's that's the type of mission that we're doing. Oh. I don't know where the police department is, actually. I think there's one right outside our apartment, ain't there? Mm. Look at you. I was going to say, look at you having crashed. <laughs> <laughs> you were doing so good. Ah. Oh, it looks like there's somebody here, uh and he's taken care of. That's some tiger claws. More damn. <laughs> Boom. Ooh, shot him right in the face. Nice. And Devastating is fucking sick. <laughs> My god, we're gonna turn into David, aren't we? Doesn't matter, we're gonna die anyway. Nice katana. Not as good as the one we got, but it's nice. And some monies. They're making drugs over here. That is so drug. They were making drugs over here. Yep. Ooh. 
A nice car. Oh yeah, this is nice as fuck. What the fuck did I do? God damn it. Wait, it's us? Are you sure? Yeah. Because it said that we entered a hostile area. Yeah, I think I ran someone over because there's a, a star on me next to the map. Point to it in the screen. Oh. Oh my god, I didn't even notice that thing. I don't know if it could just go away. I must be like, seriously, you made me go. Now the co now it's gone. Cool. <laughs> what you got for us, Wakako? Gig, we have your wife. You are to rescue Lauren Costigan, wife of Bradley Costigan, my client. She is being held captive by the Tiger Claws. If you wish to know more, read the attachment. I, I do, in fact, wish to read more. SOS, Merc needed. Rescue Lauren Costigan from the Tiger Claws building by Raymond Street. Old Sense cast long shadows and Bradley Costigan is guilty of many. As a result, he not only found himself in prison, but also invited trouble into the life of his wife, Lauren Costigan. It's your task to help her. When Bradley landed a spot behind bars, he was contacted by old acquaintances and Tiger Claws. Chips some snitches, they said. He said no. Tigers don't like that word. They kidnapped his wife and sent stills as proof. No great surprise, Bradley began to corrupt operate but he also remembered me he's promised payment and i believe he's desperate enough to be good for it my people have already tracked where the stills were taken once you have the coordinates set to work immediately okay it doesn't say shit about being stealthy so there's that ah uh, you like those oh yes i do guns are blazing or katana's a blazing oh it works because your katana's literally a blaze <laughs> There we go. We'll still be a little sneaky. Just to add some variety. Nothing wrong with being prepared. Someone there. Thought there were two, but it looks like it is just one. Warden's been iced. Out of boy. When he's on his way over to Militech Max Security. Three. So don't imagine the things you do if someone kidnapped your wife. Okay, so how the hell do I get out of here? Can you imagine if I got kidnapped? What would you do? All other thing? If I had these skills, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so if you didn't have the skills, no? Well, I'll obviously go to the police. I'm too old to pretend like I'm a badass. <laughs> <laughs> like, you're not old. Oh my god. You're not even 30. I feel old. Oh my. Okay. And 30 is still young. I like how they start playing badass music. Ooh. 
Dang. What'd you hit? Gas tank? Yeah. Go back upstairs. How many dummies have a gas tank around? Wow, that's an unfortunate position to die in. <laughs> All right. Guessing she's going to be downstairs. I'm surprised that didn't hurt. She don't look like no damn tiger claw. And 54 news. I'm Jillian Jordan. We begin now with Worker, no affiliation. Huh. Maybe they, they were just doing a side gig for the tiger claw. Mm, maybe. Lauren, where the hell are you at? I know you heard all the shooting. Why she's hiding? Just force it open, apparently. On the checklist, I've been in just about every kind of weather condition with the sword 22. Rain, sandstorms, heat waves, you name it. Back this car. You want oh, hey. I'm getting you out of here. I'm getting you out of here. What? Your husband hired me. I'll make sure you're safe. Stupid fucking worthless piece what? of shit. Her husband. <laughs> we gotta go. Come on now, we need to go. Cause they only kidnapped her because he said no to them. <laughs> what the fuck? Head down. Did she smack her? What the hell did she do? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Your transport is already arranged. Okay. What are you doing? Wait, there's combat in here? Why is there combat in here? Uh, is she following us? Lauren! It looks like she is. What's that? Holy shit! <laughs> what the fuck, lady? You need to get into business. <laughs> you shot Lauren. <laughs> Uh, Mokako, sorry, um, we kind of shot her. <laughs> <laughs> refuses to eat. Uh, find a ripper with feeding equipment. The bee refuses to eat, and I'm tired of risking more bite attacks. Let's shove a nutrient tube down her throat and be done with it. Yikes. Oh, enemies alerted. Well, after seeing what the fuck she just did, I agree. So, shove a fucking tube down her throat. Oh that my bitch God. is scary. <laughs> Right here. Oh. Behind us. Yes. I think that's gonna be my call sign, just decapitated people. Uh, rope. Did he come out of there? That man? I think they came out the front, yeah. All right, where is our ride? Is that our ride? Any one of these can be our ride. Because he, she said that, well, Congo said that transportation was arranged. Oh, probably the one just parked up front. Nope, that's not them. Oh, this one. Worked out this time. Don't get used to it. Talk to her. Uh, is there someone you can ask for help? Is there someone who can help you? Um, my mom? Tell her to lay low somewhere. They'll be looking for your family, friends. You understand? Y yeah. Oh, wh what about Brad? Just focus on yourself right now. The car's for you. Hey, see that car? It'll take you someplace safe. Thank you. We haven't actually checked yet. Hopefully it's not Tiger Claws. Right. <laughs> That jumped in the car. Yeah. Ready to take her. 
Lauren is secure. I'm informing Brad now. Thank you for your help. Contact. Hey, you crashed into us? You guys there? <laughs> oh gosh. Oh wait, you want to be cooler? All right, we're slightly cooler. <gasps> Until we go and crashed into a cop. <laughs> they are seemingly upset. All right, time for a quick little chase, huh? Oh, dick. <gasps> I thought it was going to be like Grand Theft Auto where if you crash into them, they fall off the bike, but apparently not. <laughs> that would have been me crashing into a car head on. I'd have fell off the fucking bike. <laughs> Oh god. They're after us. All units in the area, order has been restored. All oh. units instructed to return to patrol. Thought I was gonna have to jump through the roofs. I'm gonna do it anyway. <laughs> I wonder why we still have the music. We're out of the car. Oh, it's it's on the bottom left. They did oh. that for us to enjoy music. Oh, nice. The oh, fuck you. There's people. <gasps> no way. Oh, grody. Hey, did you know I love you? Aw, cute. You're my dewdrop prince, princess. I won big, Miss Call, Miss Call. It is three in the morning. Have you lost your effing mind? That's rude. Gina, my dear, chill, chill. I won it all. We're rich. I won a cat. What? What effing cat? What the hell are you talking about? It's a purebred, they said. For real, like big money cat shows. And oh my God, he purrs so loud. Philip, if you're driving home, stop right now. I'm not letting you in. But I love you. We you're rich. You're drunk again. You effing gunk. You're going to start to rehab tomorrow. This cat's going to buy a new a, a new apartment, babe. I'm blocking you. Don't you dare drive here. Door's locked and I'm and it's staying that way. Damn. Well, Philip, you ended up dead. He shouldn't have drive driven drunk. <laughs> Well, it's a good thing I didn't cross that line. <laughs> Are we supposed to be here? No. Huh. We're getting upset. <laughs> Falco. Oh, hey. Heard rumblings you're searching for David Martinez's crew. Well, you found it. Ooh, name's Falco. There's something you want. Which one was he? The driver? I don't remember his face. I'm going to have to look up. Found an XPD. Don't know who scrolled it, but it mentioned Martinez. Wanted to get in touch. Find out more. That's cool. Uh, not really. Just curious. Heard about Martinez and crew before, but never seen you guys at the afterlife. Oh, first one. We're out of the biz, out of the spotlight, gone dark as scrout scop stand coffee. Whatever you heard, the past is the past and not one we aim to dig into. Now, we did rummage around some in yours, V. Oh, wow. That's cool. The Merc who popped out of thin air and took Night City by storm and giving your history with Arasaka, well, yes, yes. You and David got more in common than you might reckon. Feels like it since my husband likes the thingy so much. What's it called? That thing that David did. Oh, Sun Devastin? Yes, Sun Devastin. Now, I'm sure you could track us down if you tried. That's why I gave you a knock first. My way of saying don't bother. Our 15 minutes might be spent, but you still got time on the block. Left something nice for you with El Capitan. Take care and good luck out there, V. 
Nice. Thanks, Falco. We'll go ahead and uh, pick that up after talking to Judy. Oh, so we don't get to meet him? Nah. That sucks. Oh. Wow. Oh, that's weird. He's jumping over poles. <laughs> Alright, Judy. What you want? Maybe she came too? I keep trying to turn off the music and I won't do it. <laughs> In the bathroom! Yeah. Oh. Uh oh, what happened? Bird offs herself to express her undying gratitude to you for saving her ass. Shut up. Stop talking. I was only gone an hour. Check your pulse. You checked your pulse? You you think she's got a pulse? <laughs> My love, why are you being rude to me? Not you, her. <laughs> How'd this happen? The game. How did this happen? I don't know. I told you. Evie was lying in bed like always when I went out. And I got back to... <sighs> Fuck. If I'd just known, I'd have... Can't blame yourself. Don't blame yourself. Won't solve anything. Ah, I should have sensed something that it was off. <laughs> Stop. Couldn't watch her 24 7. She'd made up her mind. Would have found a way. Always. Gotta do something. Gotta do something with her. Don't want any trouble. <laughs> I'm calling the badges. Can you carry her to the bed? As if that'll change anything. Shut the fuck up, Johnny. <laughs> Should we move her? She's calling the cops. I don't know. Uh, probably shouldn't move her then, yeah. Not sure we should move her before the badges get here. She's just another dead whore to them. Nobody will care. The least we can do is treat her with some dignity. All right. <laughs> we ain't got another choice. <laughs> oh. Mm. Yeah, to be fair, after all the shit she went through, probably should have seen this coming. I, I need to report an accidental death. North side, Jackson Street. No. No imminent danger. <laughs> Suicide. So, like, we'll be there in a couple so days. Right. No. Oh, yeah, tomorrow. <laughs> what part of dead don't you understand? <laughs> Wow. No, she was not pronounced dead by trauma team. If she'd have had coverage, we wouldn't be talking. And fuck you. If you don't want to move your asses, why don't I come down to the precinct and trash it into bits? Now will you come and arrest me, you pussies? I think she's upset. Fine, I don't Just give a, a fuck bit. what you write me up for. Oh my god. Huh, I hope that's not demonetizable. They'll be here soon. That's raspberry jam on her pants and all over the tub. <laughs> told me to keep her on ice until tomorrow. Can you believe the balls? That's a daily thing from when easy on them anyway. NCPD is understaffed. Second one. All things considered, you let them off pretty light. Had it been me, they'd have gotten an earful like nobody's biz. Put something on her. I'd rather she look like a person than a body. Could you wait outside? So, so you're gonna play doll with her? What the fuck?
News report 717 2062. A fatal incident occurred on Friday in Laguna Bend, a town located in the area surrounding Night City. Residents refused to vacate their homes, properties which have been officially declared a construction zone by the corporation which had purchased the land. Despite not all homes having been evacuated, construction workers were ordered to begin their work to prevent further financial losses due to delays. One resident climbed a crane in order to stall construction. The crane operator responded by lobbing objects found in his control room at the man. The operator subsequently lost control of the suspended load, which collided into a home and killed the family who were still inside. The conflict between NC Dam, LTD, and the residents is not new, but until now has not led to any casualties. The dispute began a few months ago when rent prices in Laguna Bend rose drastically, after which residents were informed that the land on which their houses stood has become was to become a reservoir. Some of the residents relocated to temporary houses housing that was built as compensation. However, those who ignored municipal directives and state put became the victims of corporate smear campaign, which identified them as agents of public unrest, APUs, who were preventing necessary construction in order to secure access to clean water for all Night City. Wow. As a resu result, public opinion quickly turned against residents of Laguna Bend and few, if any, paid attention to the change in police tactics and open violence against the residents. One could say it was only a matter of time before incidents like the one on friday would occur that was back in 2062 this is 2077 close the door v please what just happened time is passing oh oh <sighs> bummer sig didn't know you smoked. Uh, quit. It's been years. But right now I need something besides air in my lungs. Please, V, just one. We don't let Johnny smoke. <laughs> Give a fig. Fine, here. She just wants to hold it. No, she wants to smoke. Well, I know, but she wants that to hold the thing. Case. Oh. <laughs> Smoked some strange brand. She smoked some strange boutique brand. That's heavy. Whenever she pulled on a new face, it was down to the details. A lot of people know the real Evelyn. Who she really was? No. Nobody. Oh, snap. I should have her down. Give her the. I thought if I gave her some <laughs> space or time, she'd get back on her feet. Can't believe she gave up. Don't know what to say. Stay strong. Second one. I don't know what to say. Never was any good at this stuff. I'm not good at that. No, you don't need to talk. You did more for her than anyone else. I had a motive to find her, Judy. You know that. Wow, that's rude. It's what you bring that counts. You gave her the freedom to choose. Yeah, maybe. Just never imagined she'd choose this. Remember Fingers? How he said Evie was with him for four days? Uh-huh. Did say so. She disappeared from clouds a week before you turned up. Tom told me later. Couldn't sleep at night knowing that. I kept thinking, what the hell happened to those other three days? So I did some more digging in her virtues. Found Woodman. He kept her. Had his way with her. The things he did. And once he got bored, he pawned her off. Wow. So you found her other recordings? What Woodman do? Um, the first blue one? Wait, so you found other recordings? Had another look at the corrupted ones. You know, lots of static. Hard to pick up anything, really. At some point, I stumbled on something like an echo of the spat we'd had last time we saw each other. But I know she wasn't scrolling. 
Then why was it saved as a virtue? Got no explanation for it. Maybe she knew Maybe she was in danger. She recalled it later, relived it almost. Dang. Implant could have been on when, you know, as a defense mechanism, escaping into the past so as not to live in the present. What Woodman do? What did Woodman do to her? Did you see it? Yeah. And I really wish I could unsee it. Um, good thing I killed him. I zeroed Woodman. Didn't plan on it, just how the chips landed. Glad I did, though. Me too. I can't even imagine. Still, it's not enough. There are so many more like him. Gotta be something I can do about it. Like what? Don't know yet. Think I'll call Suze. Thanks, V. Sorry. But uh, I'd rather be alone now. Promise to keep in touch. Sure you don't need anything? Sure you don't need anything? No, but sweet of you to ask. All right. Anything comes up, holler on the hollow. All right, well, that's a sour note to end on, but yeah. that's our time. If you guys did enjoy the first half, at least, <laughs> please don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and we will catch y'all on the next one.